On WSA9.com, we told you about two Green Pig Bistro employees in Arlington that tested positive for COVID-19. We're told that the employees had contact with takeout food, but did not work in the kitchen, nor did they prepare the food. And that leads us to this question from this viewer. There's a lot to unpack in this next question, but let's get to it. And David wrote to us concerned about the surge in new coronavirus cases. They're concerned that food delivery may be a source of transmission. Saying this, that I don't believe restaurant workers are being broadly tested and they're likely feeding a substantial percentage of our population. Could this be a broad source causing many new infections? Well, we took the question directly to Dr. Linda Napa. The majority of people who get infected, and we're talking about the vast majority of people, it is through person-to-person -person contact. That is how we understand it from other countries such as China um, and Italy. Could you potentially touch a surface, touch something, that, you know, eat something that has the virus on it and get infected? Possibly. We don't think that is the main method of infection. All right, remember, these infect this infection lives on surfaces up to 72 hours. So, of course, we can't say that that risk is zero with eating takeout food. Um, but I can tell you and I can assure you that the main way of catching this infection is to be, in, to be infected by another person coughing or sneezing on you.